We've got two large predators here. We've got badgers and otters. Are they not fighting one another for the same food? Interesting you should ask. I have a graph to show us Do this. Do you, Michaela? Give it to me. What surprise? And the analysis was done by the Suffolk Mammal Group and Dr. Dawn Scott from the University of Brighton. And they took 25 samples of otter and badger poo, which is a, a small sample, but it gives us an idea of what they're eating. And they measured it in percentages. And let me explain that. If you have a look, the blue is the otter, and you look at the fish, in over 90% of the samples there were fish remains in it. If you look at the badger, look at the plant material, 100% of the samples had plant material in it. Look at the birds though, Martin. I mean, we know both of them will take the birds, but look how low Hardly it is. Any. Hardly, Hardly any. Hardly any at all. So I think basically what this shows us is the ba badger and the otter have a really varied diet. It crosses over a little bit, but they specialise, and the otter certainly specialises in aquatic resources. Fish, and even the invertebrates that they found, most of them were aquatic. This is a brilliant example of niche separation. So we've got these two large predators side by side, but because they're eating different sorts of food, they can not compete with each other. I think it's, a, it's a little bit like you and Chris, really, isn't it? I mean, you know, you share...